Back off! What the fuck? Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we we just want to know if y'all can... can help us out. I said fuck back off. off, Carly. We don't want any trouble. We don't. Of course, uh, neither do we. You're looking for I'm it. Andy St. John. This here's my brother Dan. We're just out looking for gasoline. Looks like you folks got the motel locked down, which, which is fine, but uh, if you could spare any gas, well, we'd be much obliged. You got any food? Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators electric provide fence. the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few Ooh. miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we your can guns. talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. It's like you somehow know that we don't have any food. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out, see if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. Why don't we just so move in together? Dairy. Live a happy life. You guys life. really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of Cow. milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. That guy looks so weird. I don't know why, he just looks weird. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you Lily started to take charge showing. more. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Hmm. Everybody looks up to you. I do. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Oh, because of oh your past. God. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I lied yeah. to her, but... What exactly did happen with the senator? Whatever they could get their hands uh, you know what happened. She I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Hmm. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. It's bad man. I uh, really appreciate that. Thanks. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Mm. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Uh, I'll just, I'll just say it's Lily runs a pretty tight ship. Her and her dad are ex-military. Yeah, she knows her shit, but she needs to know when to back off sometimes. How many people you got over there anyway? Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat I'm farm. You are yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mom's been you, running the you dairy stay with him. as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's. You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, Excuse me. Damn. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Carrie are always Jesus. in this. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided yeah, my camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. They are. And you guys were keeping it There's all for yourself. Them. Oh no, there's Yeah, you know what? More we ate it all. What are you going to fucking do about it? Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens, but let's just wait this out and hope we move on. Yeah, that sounds like a Fuck idea. you! Oh god, Jesus, fuck. Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! Oh my god. Asshole. <laughs> Was that really necessary? The here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Well, you say it's safe. Best be fucking safe. He's a dead man. Times five. Hey look, an electric fence. 
That is not a scale. Okay, yeah. Uh, the fence isn't Saint like John six foot tall. Y'all can Dan. see how he kept this place so safe. The fence keeps him out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. <laughs> We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with Jesus. generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Yeah, that that's a fucking lot. Seems like a waste, maybe? I don't know. Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down Gosh. the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. What's the He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is too vulnerable. Dead, Have you literally. got someone with survival experience to lead your group? We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. Yeah, okay. we used to work together. I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Thanks for having us. We brought some gasoline on good faith. We're all incredibly hungry. These yeah. are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't no get way. stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? Well, so we have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. Jeez. A vet? Oh my! A vet? Our prayers have been answered. Maybe God. our whole group could come. For the day. Well, how hey, about this? How about you stop making get your veterinary friend and I'll shut prepare the fuck some up. dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice Sound, to have some good. folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Danny why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone inside. for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Oh, don't die. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. Yeah, take Ben. See you in a while. That's some bonding time. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once okay. you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. <sighs> Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. How big is it? You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generator it's before a, they run dry. It's a fence. Don't you get me it. when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. Yeah, right, that Mark. Fence? Oh, man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Yeah, we can't just right. bring everyone Obviously over. they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking mm -hmm. the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. Alright, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Hey Mark, let me ask you something. So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place? No, I haven't to really, really no, lived anywhere. Yet. <laughs> All right, no. keep me posted. <laughs> Whoops. Hey, look, picket fence. Hmm, pointy. <laughs> hmm, pointy. Hey Andy, how's it going? Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Have we? I mean... Yeah. If anyone tries to fuck with us, they'll regret it. Yeah, so you well, fucking remember that. Well, protecting your people is important, but in my experience, having that many guns around is when people get dangerous. Shut the fuck up. 
We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? What the fuck do you call them? Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. <laughs> Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough no, to can't. power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Yeah. Like us. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, I good. Around enough. Fence will stop a walker I? in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Yeah. Well, that'd be great. That'd be I'll great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. No. You never know if you don't go. I just didn't look around any of that area now. I feel... Herschel's fine. <laughs> It's best looking, to turn the fence off. For us to stay, if we can. It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy. But yeah, I didn't really look around much. To secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? Yeah, what the That's fuck was that about, Mark? Enough. You fucking Sorry, spastic. Man, it, just, it popped out. <sighs> he is a piece, a piece of shit. Of shit anyway. mm. Relax. You're not making things any better riling him up. Shut the fuck up, Mark. You just called him a racist. There's one. Ugh. Yeah, that ain't Lee, nice. it's dead. You can never Come be on, sure. Come on, let's push it off. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Who do you think he was? I don't want to just look at it. Oh. Uh, at least it's not one of us. Yeah. Oh, you have the axe. Looks like he's right. stuck. Just, I'd give him the pop in the head just to make sure, you know. Looks like he's stuck. Okay, well, what do I do? Oh. Pull the arrow out? Okay. Disgusting. Now do I push him? How did that make a difference? Come on. God. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Yeah, mm. Well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's mm. your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. Why does he That's love these backs. men so much? There's another one. I see it. <laughs> Is he gay? Is that hair? Jeez, that is raggedy as shit. Give it a smack in the head to make sure it's deadly. Just give it a little clip. Oh, lovely. Let's take a look at this yeah, one. The fence burned right into its hands. Yeah, the hands are completely together. Jeez. Pop. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> oh, God. Nope. Christ. That smells great. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Ah, dinner will Thanks dinner will smell great. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but. It's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. Yeah, all right. Uh, yeah. Just focus on the focus fucking on task. The task. They knew Mom. what they were doing, teasing us with food and then giving us chores. Uh, having a good meal will be worth it. Come oh, on, no. I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we Mr. get better Crispy. leverage from the other side. Good idea. 
<laughs> Shouldn't you take him off first? Little help here, Lee. Yeah, all right. Okay. Holy fuck! What just happened? What the fuck! Why'd they turn it on? on? Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Oh shit! What the fuck? Oh my lord! Get to the gate. Jesus fucking Christ! Take cover, Lee. Take cover. Oh my God. Who the oh fuck is God, that? that no like idea. Ear. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on that gate, it's our only way out. Now uh, we're gonna have to push the track, aren't we? Behind the track, team. Show yourself. Shh, don't sh. Did you really think you could fuck with Shit. that? What do I do this you way? Asshole, rat. We had a deal. The plates are stuck in the dirt. Oh shit. Give us the food. Lift the plow up. There you go. Jesus Christ. Get now we can push it. Let's just take a peek up. Hello. Good boy. No, no, let's push this a bit. Come on, Mark, push it. You got lucky that time. Why can't I push it? What's over here? Oh, there's a fucking brick. Oh, it's not a brick, it's a thing. Come on. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the How house. How many arrows do they have? Sit there. Over there. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> they give you way too much time to do this. Oh no. What happened? What do you mean what happened? Do you have eyes? Dead, we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move him. Oh, okay. Fucking move him then. Is he dead? Tell me he's dead. Oh, he's got his dashes. Hey, let's go. Let's keep going. Why are they just proper running around? Why don't they just come down and kill us? Oh, for fuck's sake. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? Two. We, we pushed down two, Mark. Is this, is this dead? It's not dead, is it? Fuck me. It's not dead. Shit. Mark, fucking help me. For fuck's sake, where's my axe? Where actually is my axe? Where do I have my axe? No, don't bite my fingers off. Oh my lord, you just broke him in half, Lee. What the fuck? You okay? Yeah. Barely. Come on. The gate's right there. Oh my god. Where's the gate? <laughs> oh, are we safe yet? Oh god, thanks guys. Let's get out of here. Over there. He didn't close the gate. Go ahead and run. We ain't going nowhere. Oh god. Was it just night? Yeah, Mark has a fucking what's arrow wrong? on his shoulder. What do you mean what's wrong? It's a goddamn ambush out there. It was. We Holy were shit! Are, are you okay? He's and not okay. On our property? Oh my lord! What happened to you, Steve? Oh my lord! Those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out. But God damn it, hurts. Pull it out, Lee. Pull it out. Hey, Just fucking yank it out. Mark, what the fuck? Oh my god! What happened? He got, he got shot. shot. With an arrow. Christ! Are you gonna be okay? Yeah. No. I'm fine. Fuck off! You're not Just fine. Pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? Oh, fuck off. We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. Maybe it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're mm. sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. You haven't given them Listen, food. Listen, we may they have had said... an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. 
Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not mm. safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of Whoa. us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. How many guns do they what have? What we need to do is find a way to get our uh. whole group out here to stay. <sighs> Take this me. place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. <laughs> These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. He has a point. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Brenda? Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, Shut the fuck up. That's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Oh yeah, they probably ate like all the bread. <laughs> hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. Oh, Hope the kids like swings. Nice. A swing! I love swings! Uh, Just like at my treehouse! Uh, Come on, Doc! Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah! Oh. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. How nice. That's really nice. Let's look at this generator. Let's look at this generator. There we go. Yeah. I don't want to use that gate. Take a look at this electric fence, Lee. Don't I touch guess Mark it. And I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Yeah, you fucking were. Jeez, imagine if you were. You'd been fried like fucking... I don't know what, what he said earlier. I want that saw. If a couple of tools out of the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Would have been nice hmm. to have one of these back at the motor inn. Yeah. They look aboard. I bet they go through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. I mean, I guess they would, yeah. I guess they would. <laughs> Let's look at this. Oh, pointy picket fence again. Pointy? For fuck's sake. Hmm, pointy. I don't want to go up there. You guys can suck a dick. Hey, Clem. Hey, let Clem have a go. Oh, all right, Kenny's pushing him. That's that's hey, right. Hey, Clem. Do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. That's sure good. Thank you. Okay. I will. will Do you, you know push who Andy is? I don't. Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. <laughs> How are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? He got shot in the shoulder. It'd have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Yeah, I'll we'll kill him. have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Oh. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. <laughs> okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Mm. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? I'm not sure, Clem. I hope so. I hope so, too. Yeah. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me, too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. No, I will I not. Promise. I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. That very long. Thanks for pushing me. Anytime. It's all yours. Yeah. Okay, duck. Don't pop a gasket. <laughs> I speak to Kenny. Yes, I can. Hey, Kenny, how you doing? Don't push duck. Where are you going? Oh, for fuck's sake, duck's gonna kill me. Hey, Kenny. Hey, Haley. Found <laughs> anything interesting? I'm just trying to make sure this place is secure. In case we decide to make this a more long-term solution, except for those people in the woods, seems that pretty is safe. Good to know. Weird angle. Keep your ears open for anything else that might help us. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy, hands shaking, cold sweats. You refused Thought I was gonna food pass for out. me, didn't you? They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? Well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Mm. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. That's funny, considering you didn't seem too worried about Duck back at Herschel's farm. 
That's in the past. Hey. A lot's happened since then. Yeah, right. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Let's go have a look around. <laughs> 